Hi everyone. So on May the 12th, it is Nurses Day. And I just wanted to take a second on this video to talk about a very special nurse to me. Um, she is called Tina and she works at the National Hospital Queen's Square. And Tina helped me through my first brain hemorrhage and the, the years thereafter. Now, um, as, a, um, as having the honour of being the ambassador for Royal College of Nursing and for Nursing Now, um, I just wanted to give a shout out to Tina because for me, she is my super nurse. So I would like to know who is your super nurse? Who is a nurse that has affected you and helped you in your recovery? And, um, or who is a nurse that's really helped someone you have cared for and someone who you love um, through a health crisis? Because for me, I'm just gonna take a second to talk about Tina here. And um, here she is with my mum outside Queen Square, National Hospital Queen Square. Um, what Tina is, is something very special. She bridges the gap between acute care so when you're in hospital and you're being treated, you're there and you're getting checked up on and um, quite regularly and you're being made to feel um, very safe and very like, you know, someone someone is looking out for you and has got your back. And then when you leave hospital, you're itching to leave hospital, you can't wait to leave. But then when you do, you've, you're filled with so much fear um, of sort of abandonment because um, you no longer feel safe in your own home because everything has changed. So what Tina does is um, when I left hospital, right before I was when I met her and then after I left hospital, I would call her with anything. I've got a funny headache. I feel really sick. My hand is swollen because of where the drip was. Any of those things. And she had the patience and the kindness of a saint because she would listen and she would know that what might seem like a really small thing in any other circumstance. I've got a headache, I don't feel very well, something else has gone wrong. She knew that, that I needed to be heard in, in my fears because everything felt scary. And so she was remarkable in that sense. I would call her quite a lot, if I'm really honest, with all of my worries um, and all of my fears. And, um, and Tina was there for years afterwards as well, with any kind of query or question that I or my family might have, which is why she is my super nurse. Um, now the problem is, is that we don't have enough Tinas. Tina has a huge number of patients that she's looking out for, a remarkable amount of people that she is making sure knows and feels like they are her only patient, which is how she made me feel. Um, so yeah, my shout out, my super nurse, is Tina. So I just want to say thank you to Tina and thank you to all nurses for the incredible job that you do, especially on May the 12th when we get to celebrate you guys. But I want to hear about who your super nurse is. So please tell me your story of your super nurse and let's give them the love that they deserve. Thanks.